grab your yoga mat, take an easy pose because you're watching Yoga Intervention Quick Clips. We're going to do Viparita Karani, also known as Legs Up the Wall. You'll need a number of props for this, but you also can use it with just simply a vacant wall. So for the variation that we're doing today, we're going to use a bolster, three blankets, actually four blankets, and three eye pillows. To come into the pose, you'll take a bolster and bring it about an inch away from the wall. If you have instability in your low back, you won't use anything beneath you at all. So in that case, you wouldn't use a bolster. To come into the pose, you'll get right up against the wall. And then on an inhalation, you'll simultaneously lean back, roll the legs up the wall as you position your back and head on the blanket. And then once you're down, you'll extend the legs up the wall and reposition yourself as you need to. So in order to reposition yourself, what you'll need to do is to bend your knees, press the feet into the wall, and as you press the feet into the wall, you can lift your hips and then move the hips side to side, front to back, and do the same with the bolster if you're using it. And then once you're in place, slowly return the hips to the surface of the bolster, position the blanket beneath your head, and then take your arms out to the sides. You then place an eye pillow in the palms of each hand, and then the third one you'll use to cover your eyes. And then just let the legs sink in, to in toward the pelvis, Allow the inner thighs to let go. Allow the shoulders to relax. And just float away. So this has been Viparita Karani, also known as Legs Up the Wall.